Three months ago, 13-year-old Shivam went missing in the New Delhi neighborhood of Ashoknagar. He left the house to go to the temple and buy some sweets nearby, but he never returned. His parents have searched everywhere for their son and alerted the police, but so far there are no leads. I really miss him. I wake up and just wait. Whoever took my son, please give him back. Shivam is one of more than 50,000 children that, according to children's rights organizations, disappear in India every year. Some of them are kidnapped on the streets by criminal gangs who target the poor, overcrowded areas of India's capital. They are sold as cheap labor, forced to work in appalling conditions, or for prostitution. Activists say the authorities aren't doing enough to stop child trafficking because children are treated as second-class citizens. But officials claim a lack of resources and coordination on the national level makes tracing missing children difficult. Better coordination between state police chiefs would help. Secondly, it would be good if all the police station databases were connected. Campaigners say the number of missing children in India might be underestimated because many cases go unreported. They urge authorities to step up their efforts to stop child trafficking, to avoid the anguish and frustration that thousands of parents have to go through every year. Rupa Suchak, BBC News.